इजरायली पुलिस हैव अटैक डजन ऑफ वर्शिपर्स इन जेरूसलम्स अल अक्सा मॉस्क कंपाउंड इंजरिंग सेवन पीपल अकॉर्डिंग टू विटनेसेस इट वॉज नॉट इमीडिएटली क्लियर वॉट एक्चुअली स्पार्क द वायलेंस द इजरायली पुलिस सेड इट यूज फोर्स टू इवैक्यूएट वर्शिपर्स हुए होल्ड अप एट द मॉस्क विथ फायर वर्कस रॉक्स एंड स्टिक्स द रेड टुक प्लेस बिफोर डॉन टूडे विथ इजरायली पुलिस क्लेमिंग दैट दे वेर इन फैक्ट रिस्पॉन्डिंग टू राइटिंग Following this, rockets were fired at several towns in southern Israel early today morning, and then the Israeli planes also struck Gaza. The Palestinian Red Crescent reported injuries but did not elaborate on how many people were hurt. It said in a statement that Israeli forces were preventing its medics from reaching Al Aqsa. Hours later, an Israeli soldier was wounded in a suspected shooting near the West Bank city of Hebron amid heightened Israeli-Palestinian tensions during Ramadan and the start of Passover. Palestine has said that 14 people were hurt after the police used stun grenades and rubber bullets to clear out the group. No group has so far claimed responsibility, but it is believed that the militant group Hamas approved the firing of the rockets. The clashes in Israeli annexed East Jerusalem started after a number of Palestinian worshippers had barricaded themselves in the mosque after Ramadan prayers. Palestinian groups had earlier called for Muslims to lock themselves in the mosque to prevent Jewish worshippers from sacrificing a goat for Passover that begins on Wednesday. The hilltop site in Jerusalem is the most sacred place in Judaism and the third holiest in Islam. It is known to Jews as the Temple Mount, site of two biblical temples, and to Muslims as Haram Al Sharif, the site of Muhammad's ascent to heaven. The entire compound is considered to be Al Aqsa Mosque by Muslims, but the latest clashes were inside the mosque building itself. Jews and other non-Muslims are allowed to go to the compound but not pray, though Palestinians see visits by Jews as attempts to change the delicate status quo.